technology makes it much easier to connect with people that you have left in other countries. I think there's a stigma with Latino communities that, you know, we're not very book smart and that's like a stereotype that's been throughout the years. And I think that is so wrong. My mom got me started into the library. I, when I was three, my mom taught me how to read. My mother really wanted a different life for me. She was an immigrant from Mexico and she just wanted what was best for her daughter. My mom sent me like a picture and she's like, look, this is the first book that you actually read. I was born here in Yonkers. When I was seven, I think that was like a turning point in my life. My mom was deported. So my family and I had to relocate to Mexico. It wasn't very easy. I spent 10 years in Mexico, and when I was 16, I made the choice to finish my college here. And that's when the library comes back into my life. I'm very glad that I got the opportunity to reconnect. We're just surrounded by a Hispanic community that's going through the same struggles. It's important that we have the technology and that the library provides resources to help us reconnect with our families. You can still feel and look at them and just think, that you shorten the distance between you. I can do some Skyping and I can get in touch with my sister in Puerto Rico. Coming from an immigrant family, that's very important because my mom still isn't in the country. When I talk to my mom, you know, it feels like I haven't even left Mexico, that I'm still with her and I just miss her every day. So it's like that connection that helps you realize that it's only distance. My love for the library led me to my current job at the Crestwood branch in Yonkers. So if you're a patron and you need to return your book, you do it with me. I also do the basic stuff such as like putting the books back in the shelf and just making sure that everything is clean and order. 